What do you think? I'm happy. It it'll, worked out. It'll work? <laughs> that's a good thing for me because that thing right there is not cheap. And honestly, we've had it for about three years. Yeah. Let's button it up. Good morning, guys, and welcome to another episode of Bubba's Garage. I hope you guys are having a fabulous day. Yes. Guys, woke up this morning. We had to knock out a bunch of videos really, really fast. So hopefully you saw our last video and registered for that giveaway. Yes. Um, and if you haven't noticed, I shaved. <laughs> I got, honestly, I did not make it 90 days beard strong. It was pretty close. It was, it was like close. 86, something yeah, like that. Yeah, you're just a few days shy. Yeah. But today we have some beautiful weather right here in South Central Texas today. So today I'm going to spend a little bit of time on Bobby's Black Bear. Her Sun Rider soft top is, uh, I think a rivet had popped on it. And well, we're going to drill it out and see if we can fix it. You know, yeah, we've had a lot more problems with that thing that I'd care to admit. Yeah, it is what it is. No Let's fine. go take a look. <laughs> So right up here above, well, right above my head, there's, let me show you, right here. So I'm going to take a drill bit and try to drill right into the center of that thing. I'm not going to press very hard because I don't want it to go through the Sun Rider, but if I could just drill that little bead out on that rivet, I can get it to fall out and then we'll, we'll, we'll try to pop a new rivet in it. Fingers crossed. Yeah, let's, let's see if we can do that. You know, Bubba, I'll probably put a hole in it. Good thing is, I got it out. It took a five, 30 seconds drill bit to drill it out now to find out if we have any rivets to pop in there. Hope so. If not, duct tape and super glue. <laughs> yeah. Some Gorilla Glue would hold it tight. Uh-huh. Yeah. This might be uh, taken care of and nipped in the bud pretty quickly. Let's, uh, let's see if we get any rivets. All right, it looks like we're going to need a 3 16 by a half inch, half inch long, 3 16 wide. It's going to work out fairly well. Um, we actually have it, so that's a good thing. Um, the riveting tool that I'm using is just a cheap Harbor Freighter. Um, it, the tip is a little bigger, but I think it's going to work out just fine. We're going to go pop this mug in and ah, see, see what happens. <laughs> Put a little pressure on there, but not a lot of pressure. <clears throat> you got it? Mm -hmm. Ready, Freddy? Ah, I'm going to have to push it up. Ready? Mm -hmm. There we go. How's it work? Oh, yeah. I think that's going to work out pretty good. I think so, too. That's how you roll right here on Bubba's Garage. <laughs> you just drill some holes in and pop rivets and glue and duct tape. And actually, that's pretty <laughs> dead gum professional, if you ask me. Yeah. I mean, it worked that, out great. It worked out really good. And it ain't going to rattle. It ain't going to do anything. Now, honestly. So that rivet is right about there and it holds this bar in right here. There's two rivets. We just had to replace this one. But uh, it's not rattling anymore. What do you think? I'm happy. It it'll, worked out. It'll work? <laughs> That's a good thing for me because that thing right there is not cheap. And honestly, we've had it for about three years. Yeah. Let's button it up. Honestly, that was a quick fix right here in Bubba's Garage. And honestly, they really, truly don't go that well. Yeah. 99.9% of the time, they don't go that well. <laughs> I mean, honestly, though, I did mention this just a moment ago in the Jeep. And the thing is, is the Sun Rider for soft top uh, for the JK, you got that, well, it's not Sun Rider. What do you call it? What do you call it again? Best top. Best top Sun, sun Rider, Rider for, for hard, hard top. top. Man, say that three times fast. <laughs> so we got it, what, three years ago? About three you years ago. We got it for like a holiday, a birthday, a Mother's uh, Day. Who knows? Yeah. yeah. 
Mother's Day three years ago. It's held up really well. Um, it leaked there for a while. A while. Uh, we've made some tweaks and modifications. It doesn't really leak that much anymore. I mean, in a really hard storm, you'll if, have a little bit, but not like it was. If it's a crap storm, it is what it is. It's a Jeep. Right. But uh, <laughs> this is the first problem that we really had with it outside of the rain and the, the all that good stuff. Uh, I still don't. I still don't like it. I love it. I'm sorry. I, I'm not going <laughs> to pay, what is it, six, seven, eight hundred dollars for, I mean, not only does it leak, you also have to keep pop rivets in, on hand. And, uh, well... That just goes to show you, you know, again, we just do the best thing, best that we can right here in Bubba's Garage. And uh, we had the tools to do it. Uh, everything really panned out. So um, I'm, I'm glad about that. I'm, I'm glad she's happy. I'm ecstatic. Yeah. So <laughs> guys, if you like this video, do me a favor. Give us a huge, huge, huge thumbs up. And if you really like this video and want to stick around to find out what happens next right here in Bubba's Garage, please subscribe. And until next time, we'll see you on the flip side. Good night, everybody. Good night.